So this is the mineral gypsum. Uh, it's pretty easy to tell uh, based on its physical characteristics. And the most important one is hardness. It has a hardness of two on the Mohs hardness scale. And your fingernail has a hardness of three. So your fingernail can scratch it uh, in whatever form the gypsum might be in. And it kind of comes in two different forms. So it's a pretty soft mineral. This is called selenite, and it's a sort of colorless, um, clear kind of gypsum. And this one's called alabaster. They're both made of calcium sulfate, just slightly different forms. So it's a non-silicate mineral. It's a sulfate mineral. Things you might confuse it with, the other soft mineral that you commonly see is talc. And you can see that uh, you can scratch the talc with your fingernail. And it's soft, too. It'll get scratches in it. But it has a really soapy luster. Uh, so that distinguishes it from gypsum. So that's talc. The other one, you might think, oh, there's something colorless uh, and confuse it with quartz. But of course, quartz is really hard. Uh, quartz will scratch the, gra the glass plate. You can see lots of scratches there. But uh, the gypsum won't. Remember, the gypsum's soft, only a hardness of two. So if you're thinking you might have gypsum, I'd test the hardness.